the field surveys are conducted to collect the data of the different environment so these environment may be either natural or man made things so after collection of the data certain techniques are used for the interpretation of the uh, areas so these the one of the most important technique uh, is the statistical technique so here we can use the technique in geography for the interpretation uh, of the numerical information or facts and figures of the data uh, so here we have the best example of the population so population um, surveys are conducted field surveys are conducted to gather the data and this type of uh, data is important um, for the uh, for the uh, different uh, projects so here we must use the stats technique to interpret the uh, the areas where we have the statistical environment so geographer like many other scientists both in social and physical domains are facing with an information explosion actually statistics is the study of the collection analysis interpretation presentation and organization of data the amount of information and with it the amount of numerical data is increasingly at an accelerating rate most geographer have to deal with data obtained from samples rather than with all the data they could possibly have about a particular situation in this case the sample is representative of the total set of data in this slide we can see the district of the lahore so the dark shade actually represents the area which has high density of population and certain areas are under the black spots those are the areas where we have the disease regarding dengue so the high group of dengue disease patients are belongs to the high density populations so here we can interpret the data not only the population cluster but as well as with the disease spread one of the most powerful use of stats technique is in helping the geographer to decide relationship between two sets of sample data now this slide shows the population pyramid of a developing country so here we have the structure of the population of a group of the population which represents the not only the male female ratio as well as with the age group now the percentage of the population mostly is between 0 to almost 20 years of age but most of the population actually is in the 0 to 4 year of a group so it means the country has high growth rate or in other word you can say the high birth rate so the economy is actually the developing area or under developing areas where you have the high growth rate in population and but the services are not available which are actually the area of the social welfare regarding health services the water is not available for the drinking purpose or water is contaminated so the most of the developing areas the population belongs to the under 20 years of age but uh, with the passage of time the population decreases with increase in age group so this means that the death rate are actually high as compared to the other regions the major use of statistics is in helping us to make predictions or postdictions so this is actually not only gives the picture of the future growth but it also deal with the postdiction of the data the past trend of the growth gives us the story of the the previous total number of the population and the present trend of population regarding the growth rate actually gives us the future trend of the population so this actually slides gives you the accurate prediction in only the areas where you have the developed countries so the growth rate decreases with the increase in time accurate prediction is only possible where complete deterministic process is in operation 
विच विल ऑलवेज प्रोड्यूस आइडेंटिकल रिजल्ट इन आइडेंटिकल सर्कमस्टांसिस सम डेटा बिहेव इन डिफरेंट वेज एट डिफरेंट टाइम्स दिस मस्ट बी डेल्थ अंडर केयरफुल कंट्रोल कंडीशन दिस मैप शोज द एरियाज वेयर वी हैव द हाई डेथ रेट्स ऑफ द वर्ल्ड द मोस्ट ऑफ द कंट्रीज बिलोंग्स टू द अफ्रीकन नेशंस सो हेयर वी हैव द मैक्सिमम डेथ रेट सो इट बिलोंग्स टू द थर्ड वर्ल्ड एरियाज और अंडर डिवेलप्ड रीजन्स सेम इज द केस विद द नॉर्दन पार्ट ऑफ द एशिया वेयर वी हैव द हाई डेथ रेट्स बट मोस्ट ऑफ द कंट्रीज बिलोंग्स टू द हाई इनकम ग्रुप हैव लो डेथ रेट बिकॉज ऑफ द हेल्थ फेसिलिटीज एंड इंफॉर्मेशन फ्लो एंड द हाई इनकम ग्रुप ऑफ द एरिया now this is the map of the pakistan which gives us the location of the different deserts of the country the most of the south and south uh, eastern part of the country belongs to the arid and semi arid type of climate which have the areas of sindh the southern part of punjab where we have the desert uh, thar desert belongs to the sindh province and the cholistan desert belongs to the southern part of punjab the thal desert belongs to the central part of punjab and the kharan desert uh, which is actually to the western side of the balochistan so with the given statistical techniques um, we can interpret the data into to different ways so not only we can uh, interpolate the data in different graphs um, but we can make the charts as well as we can uh, draw the maps of the given data so with the help of the statistical technique we not only draw the maps uh, pie diagrams are also very important so here the data can be presented in different ways so the number of the school going children are actually totally controlled by certain type of activities here some are um, are going uh, through uh, the cars some are actually through the uh public transport and some by the walk 